Hello everyone, welcome in to Crochet Life and Stuff with Deborah Presents Tuesday Reviews. Yep, at least it's for a Tuesday. You may not be watching on a Tuesday, but that's okay. Uh, this Tuesday review is going to be about something I'm going to do a series of snacks from other places. Um, a lot of us here in the U.S. get wrapped up in U.S. type snacks. We have all seen a Pringles. Nothing wrong with Pringles. They're just potato crisps. They even say on them potato crisps and not chips because they can, yeah, long story about labeling in the U.S. But anyhow, I love to go other places and try other foods. And by other places, I mean driving to Atlanta and going to a store that sells things from other places because I live in the rural South. There's just not a lot of that around here. Today's is going to be something from, I think this, it's either Korean or it's Chinese. It is a ramen snack. This is called Popeye, Star Popeye, with some characters that of course are in a language I don't understand by a company called Samyang. And as per usual, nothing on this is sponsored by anybody. It's just me and the hubby going to the store and buying stuff. Matter of fact, on the back of this, it gives you nutrition information in four different blocks. So this was made for import and export. Um, it gives it to you in American terms, American English. It gives it to you, it, it could be French, not sure. Yeah, probably French. It also gives it to you, it looks like a British, um, set up for it because everything is in metric and the way it's set up is a little bit different than ours in America. I don't know if that will focus. No, probably not because welcome to my world and one that is most definitely Chinese. So I'm going to attempt to open this little packet. By the way, I went to H Mart. Um, H Mart is a like a supermarket that is mainly a Korean grocery store, but it has stuff from all over the world and you know all over different parts of Asia. You can get fresh stuff there. You can get, oh gosh, uh, frozen, fresh, veg, canned goods, packet goods like this. Hmm. All right, let me pour a few into my hand here. And yes, as I suspected, this is a ramen, a crunchy ramen snack. See? Oh, and I dropped one. I'm sure the cat will be over here shortly to try to crunch that. I don't know if you could hear that crunch. I'm going to put a few more in my mouth because uh, these are yummy. No, Oscar, they're not for you. Mm. It's just um, like a cracker. There's a little bit of sweetness to it. It's not spicy at all. I am not able to tolerate very spicy things anymore. I used to go to a Thai restaurant and get the Thai hot stuff. Now, not so much. Things have changed. Yeah. But these, not bad. Oh, and in this packet, supposedly, I don't know how many servings, oh, about half a package is a serving. Now, this is a quite a packed package. This is 72 grams. That can't be right. Oh, hang on. Still some of my ham. Yeah. 2.54 ounces so it's it's a good size for a packet of crunchy things to nom on I don't know where the Popeye thing came from I don't know if that's actually a licensed image or not you never know but hey try to do snack today and yes I will save most of these to share with the hubby because we like to try snacks together I'm gonna have a series of these sort of snacks around the world got a bunch of them coming up um, yes, we took a trip to H Mart in Atlanta, a basically nearly three hour round trip to go shopping. <laughs> I 
brought the coolers with us and everything so that we were prepared. But uh, yes, interesting little snacks. If you're getting a chance to try um, little crunchy snacks like this. Oh wait, there's, there's another little bit in there that is not these little curly cues. Oh, come on out. I know I saw you. Don't make me dump out the whole packet as I dump some on the floor. See, now I can't see them. Even on the package, it shows the occasional little white ball thing. Not sure what that is, but I haven't managed to get one out of the packet yet. So, mm. I'm kind of digging that. Yeah. Y'all bring these to the American market, like not just at H Mart. You will sell a boatload of these as long as you explain what they are. No, Oscar, you can't have any. Do I like them? Yeah. Would I buy them again? Absolutely. Those are really yummy. They're just mild and crunchy, and I bet they would be good on something, too. Ooh, on a salad. Instead of croutons, those things, because they're nice and crunchy and they're little and busted up. Yeah. Don't be afraid to try new things. You never know what you're going to find that's new and scary and, and foreign that you might really, really like. Thanks for joining me for Tuesday Reviews. Hope to see you soon. There's a playlist down below of all of the Tuesday Review items. Not everything is food. The next few are going to be food though. Um, come by again. Hit the like, hit the subscribe if you haven't already. I promise, I'll just bite these little crunchy things. I don't bite you. Mm -mm. See you soon, y'all.